Assalamualaikum my dear students how do you feel today hope you are well by the grace of almighty allah all of you are welcome to nibs home school this is abir hussain khan assistant teacher in mathematics at day shift of national ideal english version school today i am going to take a mathematics class for class 2 and our today's topic is geometry part 2 Today we will learn about angles and our today's lecture is 33 and which is the including of your half yearly examination. Now my dear students let us go to start our class. Here is the first division which is angle. First definition which is angle. When two rays meet a point is called a angle. When two rays meet at a point, it is called an angle. So here, two rays. So you have to draw two rays. We know that a ray have one ending point, but no definite length. So here. It is a ray then draw another ray at the same point this one then denote this point by B this point by A and this point by C then we can write in the above figure A b c and this sign is called angle sign so in the above figure angle a b c is an angle so or is angle when two rays meet at a point is called an angle here a b c is an angle now Go to the next one which is acute angle. An angle whose measurement is less than 90 degree. An angle whose measurement is less than 90 degree is called an acute angle. So here you can draw an acute angle by this way. Again draw a ray. Here is a point and here is a, there is no definite length and draw another ray this way and this is another ray and called this point is a this point is b and this point is c so here in the above figure in the above figure angle a b c angle a b c is an acute angle is an acute angle in the above figure angle a b c is an acute angle so what is acute angle an angle whose measurement is less than 90 degree is called an acute angle Hope my dear students, you have understood the definition of angle and acute angle. Now, the next one which is right angle. An angle whose measurement is equal to 90 degree is called an acute angle. An angle whose measurement is equal to 90 degree, then it is called an right angle. So, first of all, you have to draw a ray. here it is a ray now to draw right angle you have to use the protector my students this shape is called a protector so you have to use this protector to write a right angle now first of all you have to meet this point at this point 
so from the starting point of ray and the this point of your protector you have to put it on this way then look here at this line here is 90 degree at this line here is 90 degree so you have to put a point here and then you have to add this way this point and this point so here it is called a point a here it is b and here it is c and the angle a b c is a right angle so in the above figure in the above figure in the above figure angle a b c is a right angle in the above figure this is an this is a right angle my dear students look how to draw a right angle again because it is very important first of all you have to draw a ray bc then put this point on this point put this point on this point that is the starting point of your ray then find the 90 degree of your protector here you have to define this point and add this point and this point then you will get a angle abc which is a right angle now go to the next one which is obtuse angle an angle whose measurement is greater than 90 degree an angle whose measurement is greater than 90 degree is called an obtuse angle so similarly for draw an obtuse angle first of all you have to draw a ray here is the starting point and then you have to draw another ray by this way another ray by this way then called this point is a this point is b and this point is c so in the above figure in the above figure in the above figure angle a b c is an obtuse angle look at the my strengths here if i put the protector on this point and find the degree of 90 then here is 90 degree here is 90 degree so if here is 90 degree then it is bigger than 90 degree so the angle abc is called an obtuse angle my dear students hope you understood the definition of angle acute angle right angle and obtuse angle practice it at your home more and more abide by your parents take care of yourself see you soon and till then allah peace